everyone so it's just a really quick video um i haven't done a video in a little while i've a few things going on being full time on with work i had a car crash a couple of weeks ago maybe two weeks ago now so i've just not had the time and the energy just to do videos um but obviously today i've been out with one of my friends to the metro center and got a few things that i thought i'd just show in a video a little bit of an update as to what's out and about um, different sales that are on so if anyone's due to going out shopping or treating themselves this is what is on and yeah just a quick little update about how things are um, so yeah I hope everyone's well hope everyone's you know getting through everything all right I know it's an awful time really so yeah so I just thought I'd do the video get it over and done with and then I can relax for the rest of the night and take my makeup off because I just feel really I need a good bath and one of the products in here is going to do me well for the bath so the first thing i'm going to go through is claire's so i don't always go to claire's claire's used to be my favorite shop as a child because obviously they're just really like they've got some amazing things in there and they have a sale on at the moment so if you buy three products you get three free so the three most expensive you pay for the three cheaper you get for free so i went and bought um a lot of scrunchies because it's one thing that I love to wear for work if it's you know if I'm going to bed I like to put a scrunchie in rather than a hair bubble because I know there's a little bit of a thing about it damaging hair so I thought I'd go and treat myself to a few different colours so the first ones I've got here are some I've got like a it's not a mustard but it's like an off mustard yellow um scrunchie that's your first one second one's a really bright lovely um yellow and the third one is just a black general one these are 250 each obviously they're down on the sale at the moment so that's the price tag that everyone can see they were six pound each i believe no five pound each without the label on so you're getting them out for half price but that's lovely so i've got that first lot the second lot has got to be sort of my favourite. So we've got a, like a really lovely pat, like lilac colour there. Then the two here are grey and white. Again, £2.50. The third lot in here is like... So this one's... No, this one's the blue one, sorry. So it's like a lilac -y blue and this one's the lilac. So they're very similar colours. But I think this is beautiful colour as well. These are kind of my favourite ones and then you've got a really light purple so another lilac and a dark purple £2.50 again and then what I did is we bought me and my friend had picked four we really liked and then when we got to the counter and they said oh it's like three you buy three you get three free we were like well why don't we just choose one to put back and then both have three so one of us got them free but obviously we went halves on the money so these are the ones that I've picked up and I'm really happy. So obviously I've got um, nine scrunchies for the price of what three pound um, three twenty five something like that. So that's just really good. I think even at Primark you can't get that. I don't think. So I was really happy with that. Then I'll go on to whatever comes next. So we'll just go with. I went to B and M and treat myself to a little bottle of sours because I like to have a sours and. Um, lemonade on a night that's the only thing i really drink if i'm just having a little drink Um, i don't really like wine i'm not that bothered about cans so i try myself to a little drink which is nice i act like a 13 year old when i drink then we're going to primark the last the first time i went to primark was the day it actually reopened after lockdown and my intention was to go for leggings i spent 80 pound came away without leggings so i thought this time Got Primark, won't spend as much, and I'll get leggings. I've come away, spent forty pound, and forgot my leggings again. I just don't know how to do it. So first of all, I got some wipe off oval cosmetic pads because I'm really running out. I've been using the face um, cloths, so it saves like the environment and things like that. But obviously, when I come home from work, so I like to wash my face before I do my makeup and after like when I come home so that's one wipe and I only currently have two wipes now because I work five days in a row I don't have the time to be putting a washer on so I feel as though I wouldn't really want to use them so these are the days that I um, use like I have to use them and they're in the wash and I'll just have to make do and probably buy some more so these were 90p and you get a pack of 100 
The next thing I got was a new hairbrush. So this was only 90p as well for just a cheap black hairbrush, which is nothing much really. I got some smaller cotton rounds, so 120 of them for 50p. That's not bad at all. The next thing is some white plimmies. I've got myself recently um, a denim jacket and I really like like a denim jacket, a vest top and plimmies and leggings. So I got some of them. I got some knickers. Um, got that from B&M. I got some of the micellar cleansing water as well because this was only £2. So I thought that was worth getting. Because I currently use the Garnier one, but that's run out. I ordered off Look Fantastic, and when they knocked on the door for the parcel, they said they're going to have to send it back because it's leaked through the whole parcel. So I'm going to be waiting another week or so for that. So I thought, well, that'll do me for now if it works brilliant. The next thing I got, I'll leave them to last because they're sort of. I got three little black vests. They're only. Oh, the price isn't on here for some reason. And I don't know where my receipt is. I will have a look for that. My receipt here. No, that's love yours. I didn't really prepare myself for this. So three, um, one pound eighty the hour each. So that wasn't bad. I like to wear them under my work top as well. Um, I got my. I just got a cheap little deodorant because when I was in the metro centre, I forgot to take deodorant, and it's one thing I've got. If anybody knows me, everywhere I go, I have deodorant. I'm always the girl with the deodorant. So I had to buy some deodorant. I got myself a highlighter. So this is the pink diamond highlighter for £3. And this is what it looks like. I'll try and put it on there. So it's just a cute highlight. Just to give that one a go. And then last but not least, this was £5 for the neon eyeshadow palette. And I think this is a really pretty colour. I'll just take this off here. And I think there's some absolutely beautiful colours in there. So it's worth a good go trying that on. So they were £5. Then the next thing, I've just been to B&M and got some dry shampoo. As well as the alcohol. And this was like £1.29 I think. For a dry shampoo. Because mine's run out. Um, I went to Superdrug. And these were on two for £3. So that's not bad either. That's just a shoe spray. Um, one thing I've been looking for for a while is the Morphe 35 Ice Fan 35 I Ice Fantasy Palette, and been looking everywhere. Went on Depop; they were charging say thirty pound, and I thought, oh, I can't be trusted to find that. Um, when it's thirty thirty pound to buy, whatever it was, and then went on Boots, and they're not selling it anymore. And I was like, oh my goodness, am I ever going to get this palette? And then I went on Facebook on the marketplace, and a lady was selling one for twenty pound. So I've just drove like 50 miles to pick it up. Because um, we're already on our way to the Metro Centre. So we've got it. And this is the palette. Obviously this is out of date now for people that have ordered it. That keep on top of it. But to me I'm just absolutely in love with this. Um, the packaging I think is really beautiful as well. I'm trying not to touch any of the, of the colours. I just think that's such a pretty palette. I really love it. So I can't wait to use that out because I'm I'm into my pastels. It's one thing I've always said when I get married, my whole theme is pastel. And I just like the looks that you can get from pastel eyeshadows. So that's another thing I've got. And then I've got my Primark bag aside now. And then this one we got... I got a bath bomb from Lush and it was... I don't even know the name of it now. And it doesn't stay on here. But this is it and this again smells amazing and this is another reason i want to get my makeup off now is so i can go in the bath and just relax wash my hair get back to normal and just chill because my whole body is so sore and my neck is so sore so it would just be nice to just chill um anything else in here i've got um we've got some cards I've got a few things coming up from Card Factory. I went to TK Maxx and these are my last little bits. Oh, this top. So when I went to the Metro Centre, I never really planned for what I could wear. And I wore a big thick jumper and a sports top. And I'll just try and move the camera down. So I bought this. As you can see, sorry, the floor's a bit. Um, yeah, I bought this from Love Yours, I think it was called. I don't know where I've put the receipt now. I did have the receipt, so I knew what I'd spent. Um, oh, it's there. 
so yeah i love yours and it was nine pound 99 for this top and i just thought it's a big nice top probably wear it as like a nighty afterwards because it's nice and big and yeah it was just to stop me from being sweaty because there's nothing worse than going shopping and i was stood in primark half an hour and i was just absolutely boiling it's ridiculous so that was that and then the last but not least in tk max i got myself a love heart which was three pound 99 it was one of them where you go to the tills and you see it like there i just thought it's quite a nice little something to put in my makeup room just somewhere and then last but not least i really tripped myself so i've been looking for a nice rucksack kind of bag one that i can just chuck over my shoulder and then i was looking everywhere and i was like nothing's for me and then i seen this bag and i was like oh, is even dkmy a nice make like i don't know i wouldn't want to like i remember once getting a make and everyone was like awful about it when this one out and went to school so it doesn't really matter but i've always been a little bit funny like i'll only really wear if i was to wear a make it for like adidas nike um but yeah like i've never really got a nice bag so i bought this um from tk max and it's my dkmy it's my new dkmy bag basically um i love how it's got like the little letters there it's quite cute it's a lovely little bag it's got a nice little compartment in the front which i've not really took anything out of and then on the inside it's quite nice as well and it's just a bag for me to so when i go out for a walk with a dog like if i go somewhere quite far <coughs> where's that come from um i can you know put a few things in there can be comfortable on my back and this cost me 59.99 for this bag now all the other bags i've seen i was like i love it there was one smaller than this for 39.99 and i thought i'd rather spend oh no it's 49.99 and i thought i'd rather spend the extra 10 pound and get a bigger size rather than a smaller one that's going to look silly on my back like because i'm quite a big girl now um i just feel as though the little one wouldn't look as good so i tracked myself to a bag and I really like it. It's very pretty. So yeah, that's pretty much everything I bought. But I thought I'd just do a quick video, a bit like a haul, but um, just because I'm really happy with the things I've bought and I've not gone over crazy. I was quite impressed with myself because I went in the Disney store and I really could have gone crazy. Um, but yeah, I just thought I'd do a video, show everyone my little buys and some different little offers that are on at the moment as well. So hope everyone's well and i'll be back with another video soon and um yeah thank you for watching